Bonnie and along the lake shore, about 53 there, 58 for the rest of us, mostly sunny skies. An area organization is making sure kids have a creative outlet while they're in the hospital. Raya's Rainbow provides crayons, markers, paints, crafts, and other items to seven hospitals across the country, including three right here in Wisconsin. Mickey Klein joins us now with more on how the organization got its start, all inspired by a special little girl. Good morning. Morning. Well, let's talk a little bit about Raya and who she was. Raya was a special little girl. She was um, full of life, full, of very bubbly. Um, she loved to color, she loved to paint, she loved anything art. And um, when she got, when she was diagnosed with cancer, that was one of the things that she did um, to keep herself busy. Um, and she, she enjoyed it and she <coughs> um, brought all of her paint supplies and her coloring books and stuff to the hospitals. Uh, tell us a little bit about uh, Raya's life, your daughter. Mm -hmm. uh, when was she diagnosed with cancer? April 27th of 2007. She was diagnosed with a rare brain tumor um, in her brain stem, which um, prevented her from uh, doing a lot of the stuff that normal uh, two-year-old, three-year-olds would do. Um, she was paralyzed on one side of her body. So she was a right-handed little girl, and she learned to color and paint on what, using her left hand. And she just loved to do it? Was she always with crayons in hand? Always, always. Uh, always a coloring book in her, on her lap and a crayon in her hand, always. And as a mom seeing that, did you, d how did that make you feel, to see that she had found something to make her happy, even when she was so sick? A, a joy, because it did keep her happy. It kept a smile on her face at all times. And when anybody would uh, want to um, <coughs> color with her, that would make her even more happy. And how old was she when she died? She was four. She was four. Yep, she battled for 16 months. And you wanted to keep her love of, of art and how it got her through the hospital going. And how, how does the program work then? What we do is we send about 100 items to the seven hospitals that we serve across the United States um, every month. And we send things um, that would be, they would be able to do in their hospital bed. What a, what a unique program. And just knowing that your donation is helping little kids who are also in the hospital. Uh, what are the three hospitals here in Wisconsin? Um, St. Vincent's Hospital in Green Bay, um, Children's Milwaukee, and also American Family in Madison. Well, how can people help keep the program going? You can donate um, to Raya's Rainbow. Um, we are on the web, um, and um, what, what they can do is send us craft items, anything that a little girl, a little boy could do in their hospital bed. Or they can take part this weekend yes, at okay. a special event. Uh, tell us a little bit about what's happening on Saturday and um, where it's at. Um, on Saturday, we are having a, um, a special event called Miles for, um, Miles for Smiles Family Fun Event. It's at Meadowbrook Park in Howard um, from 9 a.m. until 12. And we're going to have a bounce house, dunk tank, craft items um, for sale, and, and a bunch of stuff for the kids to do. Face painting, you know, a horse will be there. It, it's going to be a fun time. Can you just show up that morning if you want to participate yes, in the walk? Can. Yep. It's um, only two and a half miles. It's only two and a half miles. So, so. if you're still sore from the marathon, <laughs> <laughs> bring the kids and, and um, you go for this uh, family fun walk. Yep. And then you have a, a big party at the park. Yes, you do. It's a, it's a big party for kids, definitely. Definitely. Well, again, she said it's at Meadowbrook Park in Howard. Mm -hmm. Fox11online.com. Click on Good Day Wisconsin, and we have a link to um, Raya's Rainbow page for more information. Again, it's this Saturday around 9 o'clock in the morning. Walk starts at 9.15, so don't be late. Mickey, thank you so much for telling us about Raya's program. Thank you, Rachel. Raya's Rainbow.